Okay, so as you can see, this doll may look familiar because I already have her, but these dolls are from my cousins in um, a whole other state. Thank you so much for these. I love them so much and they mean so much to me. So, but in today's video, I'm gonna be making a fixing up video and yeah, let's get on with it. So my cousins were super sweet and surprised me with a Grace Thomas fun book. It's a craft book and I really love it, thank you. So this is Josefina, who I'm going to be calling Josie. She came with a good amount of accessories, I think all of them. I don't know for sure, though. Um, this is Ivy. She is not named after Ivy Ling, of course, but she does have ink marks on her hand. Sorry about the blurry picture. I have a better one coming up. But she does have some ink marks on her hand, unfortunately. But I don't really care about it, so I'm just not going to make a big deal. It can maybe come out. I already tried but I don't really mind it because they're not super noticeable. So now that you have seen those, I'm going to be working on Josephina, who I'm going to be naming Josette, or just be called Josie. So let's get started with her. So I'm just going to move over here with Josephina, um, or Josette, and you start calling her that. But she is in pretty great condition. Um, sorry for the bad lighting, I am in the bathroom. So she comes with everything. Her hair has not been cut, she's braided, and it's in really, it's pretty soft. Um, she doesn't have a lot of show marks or anything, and her limbs are pretty tight, if you ask me. But to start off, I'm just gonna be taking her hair out of her braid, and then I'm going to be very carefully trying not to get her um, beautiful um, earrings wet or so they won't rust in her eyes. Oh, while I wash her hair and condition it, so with this part, I'm going to be um, doing this in a time lapse so that you guys can just watch it and then it won't take as long. So I'm doing magic eraser while her hair is conditioning, and yeah, back to the video. I didn't end up showing you how filthy the magic eraser was. It was dirty enough where to every limb I had to rinse it off because it was that bad. But thank goodness for magic erasers and now she's all clean. Thank goodness for the braid because her hair wasn't snarly like at all. But with Ivy's hair, I didn't end up washing it because I didn't think it needed to be. Her hair was in like perfect condition and she wasn't filthy whatsoever. So since I already had number 22, I actually gave Ivy freckles. I thought it was a fun idea and I think they turned out pretty good considering I've never done that before. So I also straightened Josette's hair because it was a little fried at the ends, but now it's perfect and amazing. So here are their before and after shots. I think they turned out amazing and I'm really proud of Ivy's um, little customization, if you even call it that. But, okay, anyways, I think that um, Josette's hair turned out awesome too. Thank you guys so much for watching this video though. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in future videos. Bye! 